I'm going to show you how to build a custom fireplace with a chimney. Welcome back to Sons of the Forest. Well, with this update, we got stones. And I'm going to build a custom chimney with in a built-in fireplace. And we're going to start with the back wall where I'll be putting the chimney. I'm going to start on the... Uh, try to get a flat ground. This is a little slope, so I'm going to try to start uh, at the top of the slope and work my way down. We'll start by just creating a foundation to work with with stone and build a square. So it's four across. Okay, this is going to be the foundation to our chimney. Now that I started on the high spot, the high part of the slope, work my way toward the lower part, I have a larger uh, distance between my top to bottom. I, it really don't matter. Flat would be uh, ideal. But we're going to run with this. And now this is the foundation to the chimney. And now I want to put a floor, some floor planks on it. Oh, maybe I needed that. Okay, we're going to pop these in there. Done. Let me toss this out of the way. Grab the fireplace. And we're going to want to sit this. Okay. We're going to pull it forward as much as we can without it turning red. And we want to center it. So you're going to have to find that center spot. See what that looks like. That looks a little heavy to the on the right side. Okay. We don't want to build that yet, but we do want to box it in. Like that. Don't build the fireplace yet. So this is where I'm having is you stacking. All right, we got that. All right, here we go. Okay. Now we're going to build the wall. You don't want to build this yet. Um, not, not just yet. Because it may interfere with what you're doing back here. Alright, I'm going to have to give him a new direction and new path okay I just build it up a little bit I got one more row I want to do on the top if I can 
bring it up to the height of what the fireplace is going to be. So I like, you can put three on pretty quick, but getting that fourth one, or if you just have two and you want to put, pick up another two, it takes a little bit to find that spot. I think I'm going to build probably a three by three. So I'll build a three by three, meaning one space, two space, three space. I think I want stone wall on both sides. that back. I think I want wood. Alright, I'm gonna pop down a floor first. Might actually go stone wall in the back. I'm not sure. Stone wall it is. Okay. over. All right, now I want to put post in each of these corners. At this point, you want to get a save on your uh, game because you, because you cannot put that fireplace inside there unless you build it first the way I did it. Still put your four stone in the spot that I need to post to build my wall. Yeah. 
All right, nice. Let me build that up. All right, that's about where I want it now. Now I'm gonna work on this floor a little. We need to get some planks in here. Okay, let me square all this up. get my first couple over here okay then I'm gonna grab two because I want it to go underneath without me having to put one like if if I have to just put one piece and it happens to be the last piece under the fireplace there it's really hard to do Yeah, so if I had to just go grab a piece and come back and do this, um, that last piece would, yeah, it's a pain in the butt. All right, and here is where we're at. So now I, I'm just going to put a couple posts in, and then I'm going to build the fireplace. Oh, that's a lot of stones. All right, yeah, uh, put a couple posts in and get this guy to get some more stones. All right, I can do that and connect that. Same on this side. All right, um, gonna have to find some stones and get this built. Well, there's our custom fireplace in our stone wall. Now we need to build the ceiling up higher. I want to extend this, the height of the ceiling to about a quarter log higher than what it is now. Start with a couple of cool logs. I'm going to run it across the fireplace. See if this is even possible. I think because the fireplace is the actual stone that I'm trying to put this on, we're going to come up with another plan and we're going to go up one more layer with stone and see if we can go all the way across. here there we go yes all right that's the trick right there so we can get some uh, lumber on top <laughs> I need to do my quarter post first. Yeah, 
And I need to get rid of the zip line. Okay, zip line gone. some more wood real quick Now I need a way up. And a nice chop there. Split this one in half. three-quarter piece over here. I got a half. <laughs> That'll work perfect. Almost perfect. top there and then one under it hopefully can we get one under yes we can Okay, how to long just go through the world. Two under there. Alright, I just need one here. a little bit more and we'll revisit this all right here's where I'm at I have the quarter logs cut down and put on top to extend my ceiling out now I'm going to go ahead and put my beams across on top let's take a look at it now I went ahead and extended the chimney all right all the way up you're gonna have to build plank floors in between about every about that high put a floor plank in there and build up some more and then put another plank in there until you get to the roof uh, you do not want to fall in there because it's just you don't want to fall in there so make a plank about that high don't go past your head height let's go ahead and check out the inside my little hunting cabinet cabin I didn't do anything special with the roof there you have it that is a custom fireplace with a chimney 
Alright, well, I hope you liked the video. Hope you hit that like and hit that subscribe and stay tuned for future videos. Um, got a lot, a lot to do in this game and a lot I want to do. So until the next adventure, this is King Drama. Bye.